week, guys. Scott and Megan from South Africa. Hey. We're just here to tell you a story about some good news we've been waiting for. As you know, we're a part of Fire and Fragrance here in South Africa, and one of the main ministries that we're a part of, among others, is um, RTC, which is Respect the Corners. So we use sport and fitness as a platform or a tool in how to share the gospel. So we gather people and um, we get to work out together, we get to expose things, and then we share the gospel with them. It's also just a great opportunity to gather people who love mutual things, and we end up um, basically giving people permission to really love God with everything in them, um, calling them to holiness, and even sharing with them how to um, share their own testimony and share mm. the good news about God. So I'm excited to share with you what we're doing and what good news we were waiting for for a while. And so right now we're doing a few things. We built a mobile CrossFit trailer and so we use it to gather young people predominantly right now. So we gather anywhere from about 10 to 40 young university students at a park. We do a workout, share the gospel, disciple them because a lot of them know Jesus already but are still young in their faith. So it becomes just a beautiful way to gather and disciple young people. Something that we've been waiting for is since before we even got here, we've been, been believing that God spoke to us about having God giving us a gym that we could do ministry out of into the city and into the nation. And so we've been waiting for the last two years for a gym, for either for God to give us one or give us the finances for one. Yeah, so the good news is after two years of waiting, Yes, God gave us one. <laughs> it's been amazing. It's yeah. wild. I mean, it's a little late here, so we're a little mellow, but it's exciting because yeah. Fine Fragrance has raised, we raised enough money as a ministry to buy a part of a building where we want to buy the whole building, but we bought this one part of the building where we will have a gym, hopefully by the end of the year, but God gave us a gym. Yeah. And so now we have a gym. So now we're working on raising money to remodel it, put equipment in it, but God is faithful. We've realized that We've learned about God and our relationship with him, that he is faithful. Even though we waited two years, God did so many beautiful things in the waiting, because he still spoke to us specific things about what we we're supposed to do in the waiting, which doesn't mean that he's not faithful in the thing that he said he's gonna do for the long period, is just us waiting and him developing character in us in whatnot and so it's just been amazing to just see God's faithfulness in us yeah and this is really cool because our, our base is growing we need our prayer room to be expanded we need more office space and of all the things the ministry that they prayed about and gave space to is RTC so we are just blown away by what God's doing and just believing um, and seeing that he's a missional God, seeing that he wants to raise up young people, seeing that he cares about sending coaches into the nations, all these things we, we are believing for is actually the same heart that God has. Yeah. Amen. Hopefully you guys are encouraged. <laughs> God is faithful. So good. Hope that good news is good news for you. Love you guys. Love you guys. Bye. Bye.